Ah, good morning, old hillbilly Joe here. I come down to the cabin this morning and I done seen this. Somebody done cut the papaya plant. Ah, some idiot cut the papaya plant because I don't know why. Maybe they envy the papaya plant, but they decided to kill the papaya plant. I don't know. They thinking that, oh, we're gonna clean it up or something, I don't know. But why they cut the papaya plant? I don't know. Maybe just they were tongue of people, didn't know why, and decided just to wreck the papaya plant. It's a sad day for the papaya plant because they have no heart for the papaya plant. It's food and they decide to cut the papaya plant. Sad, man, sad. But anyway, let me take you over here and I'm gonna tell you what I'm doing right now. Well, I'm gonna take this right here. And I'm gonna go ahead. And I'm gonna put it on the window. What this is, this is aluminum screen. And what am I gonna use that aluminum screen for? Well, they got silly people that like to do silly things, like throw stones and break windows. And what I'm gonna do this, is I'm gonna take that, I'm gonna have, put it right there, okay? I'll put it right across there to protect them windows. The four by 11 window, and this four by eight window. I'm gonna take this screen, and it's got different purposes. One, it stops stupid people from throwing rocks at it and breaking the windows because they love playing stupid, okay? And then, it also serves another purpose it, other than protecting from the stones. It keeps the mosquitoes out, huh? A little more, a little more, it keeps the mosquitoes out of your house. Anyway, I'm gonna share you an update later on on what this is gonna look like when I'm finished. Okay, old hillbilly Joe. I'm gonna show you a little bit more update later. All right, here we go. Right here, you can see uh, other people. They come down and they're cleaning up this wood. And if you uh, clean up the wood, and uh, it won't go to rot. It won't rot away and go to waste. See, I'm not the only person that takes and cooks with wood. Uh, other people come down here and they chop this up and clean it up so it looks better. Right now they took and cleaned it up, chopped it up, and they're going to be cutting up all that other wood right there too. So it don't go to waste. Because some other people, they cook with wood just like I do. Okay? And then they make the place look beautiful. And as you can see, uh, it's going to be cleaned up and everything right now. And uh, we're going to put some plants in there. Later on, we're gonna put plants inside here. So we got green vegetation, but that's a little later on. We can put commodity root and some other vegetables on the side. So you can uh, plant vegetables in here on the side. Adds a little bit more dirt. You know, you see the erosion of uh, uh, the erosion happening with this tree. When it rains down here, huh, the water washes away all the dirt. And that's why the tree is exposed. The roots are exposed. It's a big old tree. Huh? It's a big old tree. And just hopefully it doesn't fall down. Huh? Well, later on, we're going to make this area right here. We're going to plant some. Oaky roots, some flowers, some banana plants, some uh, whatever kind of vegetables we put on the side of this uh, hill or on the side between here and this road to make it look, you know, beautiful. You don't want to look at trashy looking and everything like that. But 
right now, you can see, this guy here, he comes down and he spends some time cleaning, planting, make it look pretty. And he's gonna plant some vegetables, you know, and some flowers and stuff. Stuff that God loves to make it beautiful. Uh, this is what he's doing. And this guy here, he cuts wood. And he cuts the wood and he uses it for cooking. And he plants vegetables. Everything that God loves, he plants, he builds, and uh, makes everything beautiful. Because God loves beauty. And he plants vegetables for food. I plant vegetables and everything like that. Yes. And he takes this wood and he cooks with the wood. Uh, he cooks with the wood. And he cook, cook on wood. All right. Yes. Okay, and then we come down here. You can see the roots here, and the roots. Oh yes. Yes. Ah, uh, see? <laughs> it's what God wants. Okay, this is Old Hillbilly Joe. Signing off till next time. Okay, y'all, Old Hillbilly Joe here giving you an update on the finished screening on the front of this building. We put aluminum mosquito screen on the front of this building. Now that's there to protect from a rock or something that might hit my window. Right now it's looking pretty good. It just needs a good paint job on the outside and a couple of these little boards up here by the roof. That just needs to be a little bit fixed, you know, and then we can put some good paint on the outside of this cabin. We took down that uh, water collection system because I don't want it on that side no more. So we're gonna move it. Might move it to the other side. I haven't decided yet, but that's what it looks like. The windows are finished. You can see, uh, you can still see mirror image of the trees on the other side over there. But both of these other sides over there, both that one and that one, the windows are open, so the air is flowing through it just perfectly fine. So it's not bad at all. And uh, so that's what it looks like. And I'm pretty happy with the results of it. We got airflow coming through. We got the bugs to stay out. And it's looking pretty good for uh, uh, all the remodeling we're doing to this thing here. And. Uh, this takes a little time, a little energy, a little bit of love to make it look pretty. But that's what it's looking like right now. It's not bad for a up-to-date version here. We're updating it, you know, the, we painted that uh, rebar black. We removed all the old metal. We uh, put the uh, windows in, special ordered. 
So we got aluminum screening on the outside here for it won't rust. Zip tied so they don't rust. And the uh, framing for the window is made of aluminum. And it's got mirror effect on the outside here so you have a mirror effect. And it's smoked and it's one quarter inch thick glass so it's all right. You know, giving an up-to-date version, up-to-date, beautiful, you know, little cabin we got going on here.